once again, I'm having to be proven right. I knew this would happen eventually. I didn't think it would take this long. Or it might have even took it longer. But it finally happened. The state and the apparatus of that particular brand of capital, that is moderators, are in contradiction. And now they're having to make a choice. They should have made this choice a long time ago, but they hemmed and hawed and here we are. So as you know, Trump is mad at Twitter. What a surprise. And now, of course, the goalpost is moved yet again. Do not let them move the goalpost. They always used to say, oh, Twitter can ban you, Facebook can ban you, Reddit can ban you because you know it. your First Amendment doesn't apply. Shut up. It has nothing to do with the First Amendment. Don't mention the First Amendment. I don't give a fuck about the First Amendment. The fact of the matter is, are you a publisher or are you a platform? If you're a platform, you haven't been doing your job as a platform. You're going to jail. If you're a publisher, hey, upload a bomb threat. Upload some child porn. Sell some heroin. You're going to jail. That's it. That's it. So... It's leaning toward them being a publisher, at least Twitter anyway. I know the U.S. government, and the U.S. government is going to pick and choose who's a platform and who's a publisher based on uh, wheeling and dealing. Uh, essentially, Section 230 is an elaborate wheeling and dealing. It's not even a law. It's an agreement between the U.S. government and private corporations that you scratch my back and I'll scratch yours. The fact of the matter is, if you read Section 230 in its completion, you will see that the American government is well aware of the fact that the very concept of moderators and the very concept of websites is at least bordering on criminal. But if they at least show some, you know, attempt to keep it under wraps, keep it under control, they'll look the other way because they make a lot of money. And at the end of the day, that's all the U.S. cares about is making money. So if you continue to make money and you make at least minimal effort to act like you're abiding by the law, then you're good. But they couldn't even do that because moderators are egotistical maniacs. So here we are. And I'm not going to sit here and fantasize about seeing every single mod behind bars or dead. I'm not an idiot. I, I know how corrupt the U.S. government is, uh, hell, the, the whole world is, but especially the U.S., um, but I will say this, they will start picking and choosing who is and who isn't considered a moderator criminal. It's not going to be perfect, it's not going to be what I would do, but expect to see relatively soon, uh, you know, some moderators going to prison and some not. And also, don't don't worry about, oh, you, these, these posturers that are like, oh, you know, well then sue me. I don't have to sue you, motherfucker. You're going to criminal court. It's not civil court. I'm not suing you. The, the guy down the street isn't suing you. You're getting sued by the government. You're getting sued by your state. You worry about that shit on your own, bitch. 